We're in Tuscaloosa, Alabama. Population 80,000, and you can bet that most of them are in the stadium today. This coin toss presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Alabama has lined up for the kickoff, and we're ready to get this one underway. He just drills this one. Gets to about the 17-yard line. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. throws it away. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Second and ten. Ball on the 17-yard line. Slings it. Brought down at the 30. A quarterback's best friend is a receiver he can count on to catch the ball every time he drops back to pass. He's got another one, and he's tackled at the 41. Good job here by the receiver to look the ball in and ensure he had possession. That's the right way to catch a pass. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry, and he's taken down at the 48. You don't always need to throw the ball with a lot of zip, although it does help in some cases. When you have accuracy like this guy, you can make all the throws. At the 37 yard line. Quick throw out to the receiver. And they make the stop at about the 33 yard line. Here's the eighth play of the series. Really one of the very tough places to play in college football, and it's no different today. Quick throw. He's tackled at the 20. The defense was just all over that play. It didn't fool anybody. And this is the 10th play of the drive. Now he's scrambling. He's got the corner. Tackle made at the 20-yard line. This crowd can really be intimidating for an opposing team. Throws and it's incomplete. <laughs> he threw that ball so hard, I don't think anybody wanted to catch it. So it's fourth down. So the kicking team is on the field. They'll try for three. Duke could take the lead with this field goal. Kicks away. And it's through the uprights. Well, that one looked like it was going to be wide, but he put it inside the upright. Yeah, he squeaked that one in, and he didn't have much more than a couple of inches to spare. Reed has the ball set, and he looks ready to kick this one deep. And he's tackled at the 24. Alabama's coaching staff, the fans, I think everybody's been waiting to see this kid play, and here he is. He's a star quarterback. He seems to bring everything to the table. The crowd, I think, senses he's ready to have a big day. And when your star quarterback feels good playing at home and he gets off to a good start, some big things can happen for this offense. And he's tackled right away.
catches it, and he's punished. Dumps it complete to the halfback, over the middle. He's taken down, right around the 46-yard line. play was over before it got started. That was just a case of the offensive line getting beat at the snap of the ball. Bobo is back deep to return the punt. And he can't hang on to the ball. I'd say a few plays in football can test your concentration like returning punts. You gotta see the ball into your hands while not worrying about being hit. Last drive resulted in a field goal. And the offense will come back out looking to do one better. Duke holds a field goal lead. He's out to the 30. He's to the 40. Across midfield. He gets hit out of bounds at the 43-yard line. Oh, that was one beauty of an option by that quarterback. No question. There was no hesitation whatsoever. Once he saw that hole, he turned it upfield and left everybody in the dust. Makes it to the 31. Gains his way to the 20-yard line. Caught open field, and down he goes, right around the 10-yard line. This crowd comes to play themselves. Rose to the receiver, got it for the touchdown. He splits the uprights with the extra point. A seven-play, 82-yard drive, and they come away with seven points. The score now, 10-0, and it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Gathered in at the six. Gets to about the 27-yard line. Let's see if this drive has a more rewarding conclusion than their last, which ended with a punt. They've been beaten soundly on both sides of the ball, and we haven't even gotten to the second quarter. He makes it out to maybe the 30-yard line. Step 
picks up at the 45-yard line. The offensive lineman played that one perfectly, giving the tailback plenty of space to work with, and he took advantage of it. And he makes it out to about the 44-yard line. He's got room to work. That was a close one, but the ball goes out of bounds. From the 35-yard line. First down. They bring him down in the backfield. That is just a great play getting into the backfield. This guy is so quick that the ball carrier never had a chance. And this play is number eight on the drive. And now they're faced with another third and long as they try to convert and move those chains again. And he's hit before he can go anywhere. It was a well-designed and executed pattern, but on third down and forever, it just wasn't enough. And they can make this a one-possession game with this kick right here. Kicks up, and he splits the uprights. That one looked like cake for this kid. Chalked up three points for the offense. Our score after the field goal. Duke, 10, Alabama, 3. Alabama is ready to kick it away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Duke's the team that was supposed to roll over and play dead in this football game, and they're not doing that. I think what we've seen so far is some good execution, but just more of an attitude. They have shown up to play in this game with a confidence and a belief in one another that they're going to pull off an upset today. Pretty good-looking touchdown drive the last time these guys were out there. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Quick release. Oh, and it knocked out. That's the kind of field vision you want out of your linebackers. They have to play well in coverage, and they have to be able to break up pass plays. Second down and 10 to go. Ball in the 25. Quick pass. And he is drilled. The 24-yard line. It's arguably the loudest crowd in the nation, and they are turning it up a notch. And they push him out at about the 31. Duke is up by a touchdown. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. He's taken down with the 36. DoorDash has the restaurants you crave at your fingertips. Yard line. The Blue Devils are smothering the opposition so far today. What's this offense got to do to get off the schneid? Well, you've talked to offensive coordinators about that, and they'll say we've got to find our go-to guy. Who are our players that we know we can count on, and what are the plays that we typically feel the most confident about? That's usually where the offenses tend to go when they're getting shut down. Hey, like this. He's going to try and scramble. And he hits him hard at the 41-yard line. 